the video explains about the implementation of a 4x4 array multiplier in cadence virtue so here the schematic design of a 4x4 array multiplier which is implemented using end gates half adders and full adders is shown these are the partial products p0 p1 p2 p3 up to p7 they are the partial products that are generated from this 4 by 4 array multiplier now let me show the design how it is implemented in cadence virtue so i have already created the designs that are required to implement this array multiplier and gate half adder and full adders so these are the three components which are required to complete the design already created the end gate with two inputs half adder with two inputs and some c out then a full adder with a b c in as the input sum c out as the output all the three designs are placed to complete this design these are the four end gates which are placed at the top and i have used the multiplicand and multiplier as x and y starting from x0 to x3 then y0 to y3 so total i'll have eight partial products right from p0 to p7 now once the design is completed create the test bench and provide the required inputs for this so i have taken x0 to x3 as a multiplicand y0 to y3 as a multiplier p0 to p7 as the partial products for this 4 by 4 array multiplier let me check the inputs press q on the keyboard pulse width is 2.5 nanoseconds period is 5 nanoseconds similarly for the rest of the inputs 5 nanoseconds 10 nanoseconds x2 pulse width is 7.5 nanoseconds period is 15 nanoseconds pulse width is 50 nanoseconds and period is 30 nanoseconds the same values are applied for this and a dc voltage of 1 volt once the design and inputs are provided check and save the design go to launch or if you want you can see the inner content of this design select this design shift e to say how the design is implemented shift e again this is implemented by using the full add check and save 
again check and save check and save once the design is completed go to the launch adel choose the analysis select the tran i want to perform the analysis up to 30 nanoseconds then select the outputs from the design x0 x1 x2 x3 is the multiplicand y0 y1 y2 y3 is the multiplier and p0 to p7 i want to plot p0 p1 p2 p3 p4 p5 p6 and p7 if you want you can check all of this x0 to p7 click on ok finally click netlist and run the transient is performed up to 30 nanoseconds So all the waveforms are plotted. So right from P0 to P7. These are the partial products which are generated for these inputs. If you want, you can verify the input and output. So just press V on this keyboard and check the combinations for all of the inputs that is provided from X0 to Y3 and check the respective partial products similarly you can move or slide this for various combinations in this way you can complete the design of a 4x4 array multiplier and verify the design